What were meant to be scenes of joy turned to panic, then horror. Tens of thousands of mostly ultra-Orthodox Jews had gathered in northern Israel for a festival honoring a second-century rabbi when tragedy struck. Eyewitnesses say members of the crowd slipped in a narrow passageway, causing a crush. We saw people pushing and slowly we saw people being trampled. That's the moment I left and then I saw people being evacuated and CPR being carried out on them. Rescue efforts continued into the early hours, with ambulances lining the street and military helicopters airlifting the wounded to hospital. The Lagba Omer festival was the first of its kind to be held legally since Israel lifted nearly all of its COVID restrictions. Authorities had permitted 10,000 people to attend, but reports say far more showed up. As countries come out of their lockdowns around COVID, uh, we need to recognise that the emergency services may be uh, ill-prepared uh, because it's been such a long time since they've had to deal with large-scale crowd events. So this is very much about a failure in crowd management and a failure in planning and not about something inherently bad about being in a crowd. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu called it a heavy disaster. It is one of the country's deadliest in its civilian history. And as the Prime Minister visited the site today, grief turned to anger after this holy site saw rejoicing become mourning. Helena Humphrey, 5 News, 